It's basically just a riff over there. So it's just trying to make it, it, it's, you know, just utilize what is there, build it into mel melody and just create this contrast, you know, and then we yeah, we play it fast, we play it slow, you know, but the, so there's not much to it, but I think separately they wouldn't be as meaningful, but when, you know, combine, even for simplicity, it's kind of a, it makes it more interesting. So, so I think that was part of developing our sound, you know, and then having the ebb and flow of, of synthesizers and stuff in there, you know, we, we felt we were onto something. So, um, uh, you know, m moving forward, uh, I guess um, I could do some other examples as well. By, by the time we did the uh, anthems, uh, or, or, or I'll do another ex example, let's say, of, uh, of Eclipse. Um, for uh, Burning Shadows of Silence, we played that uh, yesterday. And this is also the kind of combining techniques. Yeah, also <laughs> 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 uh, in the middle of the song, just a riff <laughs> But that's all. It becomes almost like a pad because all the strings are are ringing together, and uh, and then kind of what can I say? Punctuating that. You know, Samuel's guitar and the bass will go. You know, it's the same thing. And uh, another example, Ino Satana, the verse. Jazzy.